Hey, Dad. Yes? I want to know something. Well, you're asking the wisest stallion in Eritrum, Pierce. Um, so today in class, Miss Viola was teaching us about herbs, and then Connor walked in. Mm -hmm. He looked really angry. Really? Yeah. Then he said, damn. And I was wondering... Dismiss early, damn it! Who cops on our borders? What does it mean? You, you know what beavers are, right? Yes. Well, he was talking about a beaver dam. Oh, because he said something about borders. So the beavers were coming to attack the lion's borders, and all the head lion had to do was roar. And then the beavers retreated, and then everything was alright because the beavers went back home. You know what, Dad? I like standing next to you. You make me feel so strong. Well, let's go home now. Mommy? Mom? Hello? Pierce, my little warrior. <laughs> Is everyone all right, Otis? The children? Yes, yes. The children are fine. We lost seven cottages. What did Cochran say? He said, raise the flags. We're going to war. If what he says is true, do you think we'll win? We'll have to. For Pierce. Pierce? Pierce? Please don't tell me you're... What? I have no idea what you're talking about, Clark. Gossamer dared you to a spa. You're gonna back out or you're gonna earn your place in the carnage? Clark... Come on, Thatcher. You know how I feel about sparring. It bothers me. I know you only ever want to impress your parents in the higher tiers. But hanging back and watching the parade isn't going to excel you in the future. You're part of some fancy lineage. Now's the time to prove it. Can I just say I won? I have the power. You can't weasel your way out of a brawl, Pierce. Not anymore. People will stop talking. They won't regard you as their king. I'll try. Okay? That's a big word.
You've been ranked up to Abacadus. You passed your three stages, Gossamer. We'll hold a ceremony tonight. Congratulations! Sweet! That's your seat over there. What the hell? Hey, hey! Would you like to be de-ranked again, Pierce? Did you hear what he said? I said nice spar. Jesus, Pierce. Have a seat. You're not listening! Have a seat, Pierce! Well, that didn't last long. Listen, Clock. I've had about enough of your sarcasm and everybody's put-downs. Leave me alone until you have something uplifting to say. I was being funny! Well, your version of funny is making everyone else feel like scum. Pierce, come on! Knock first, Pierce. Where is your training gear? Do you even know where it's at? Pierce, Connor made that medal for you. Are you just going to let it sit outside? Mother, stop asking questions. Why can't you realize that I'm just worried about you? Where's dad? He had to go speak with Helios. About what? I don't know. I'm not sure which direction Gurkhoth will be aiming from, but the Carnage and I are guessing they'll be taking coverage in Farron Woods. They've got direct aim towards my hollow. Cochrane's kingdom is larger than ours, Otis. They could destroy us in moments. I've dealt with Cochrane Cethus before. They're agile and quick. Took down two of our Vakadis. We could negotiate with Cochrane. If they weren't easy to negotiate with, their king certainly won't be. Yes, well, perhaps we can... Carve a trail through the village, come closer to Grugal. Traveling through the village would get us beheaded. They're only townsfolk, Wheels. Cannibalistic townsfolk. Many of them, Otis. Then we must send in our most skilled Ari. No. If you think you're going to send my daughter through that, you've got the wrong idea. If you wish for Arichim to fall miserably to Grugoth, then we'll just keep her safe and sound at home. She was ranked up to that tier for a reason, my friend. Unless you wish to put a reach from his future in peril. No, sir. Otis, sir. Your son. Is he alright? Pierce is fine. He lost his spar to Gossamer. He was deranked to Roman again. That's the lowest rank. Son. Where are you going? Away. I will not allow you to run away from your mistakes, Pierce. Give me a good reason why I should stay. All I ever do is get beaten up in Eritrim by the people I might rule one day. All I ever do is get put down. All that ever happens between you and I is an argument. Tell me why the hell I should continue living here. Because you're my son. You're my lineage. If you leave, you'll ruin this kingdom. <laughs> Who says you can't replace me? Because I can't replace you, Pierce. I lost my spar, Dad. You should want to stab my neck. It embarrasses you. I know it does. Admit to it. Pierce, I can make a good friend, but a better enemy. Oh, please don't hurt me. I've endured more than you ever would in one day. All I ever get told is to take a seat. Straighten up. Maybe I don't exactly appreciate being your son. Knock it off, Pierce. I'm a screw-up, huh? You and Mom talk about it all the time behind my back. I know it. She tells me lies. She won't ever speak up because you told her not to. She's afraid to. I love your mother with everything I have. I went through hell and back to keep her for my own. Isn't that sweet? 
Well, why you two treat me more like a squire than your own son? I'll be heading off. Don't you dare.